Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to take you guys to a place that I've been wanting to explore for a very long time. I've got a beautiful new canoe and the water is so still and calm this morning. It's a perfect time to go paddling and I'm going to take you guys to a very beautiful place. So in here is like a really long bay. This is like a big peninsula. That's the bigger water over there. And in here, I love this place because of the view. I love this place. Day to be out exploring. Probably go for a swim. It is uh, early September right now, and it's pretty beautiful out. So I got a new canoe. I um, if you've been following my channel for any length of time, you'll know I had a um. I had a Swift Key Wade in 16, a uh, tandem canoe. And ever since Brandon and I did our double solo last year, we've been talking about just getting two solo canoes because we never really, we, we just prefer it. So I talked to Swift and I traded in my tandem canoe and I got a Swift Key Wade in 15 solo. So it's kind of cool to be able to paddle a new boat and a uh, very pretty boat. <laughs> I'm all packed up, ready to take off, and 
uh, it's just starting to get busy in this bay with boat traffic and stuff, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna pack up and get out of here, but um, just before I go, I wanted to show you guys. I got a new otter tail paddle from Badger Paddles. Typically use my double paddle when I am solo canoeing, um, but I'm also a bit of a traditionalist and I like using a single blade as well. Um, especially when it's calm, there's nothing better than just using a single blade paddle. And anyways, so that's my new paddle. I'm going to hit the water now. The wind is picking up and of course I have a headwind to get out of here. My double paddle is just uh, one I've had for a little while now from bending branches. It's a nice looking paddle. Bye, beautiful place. Well, I'm on big water now and the wind is not too bad. The big swells from the boat waves, but, but not too bad at all. Been paddling for about 15 minutes, took me about about that to get out of the out of the bay there. And Be back to my truck in about 10 15 minutes. Not too bad at all, and the wind is not not too bad out here. I think it was just funneling through that channel, which made made for a bit of a headwind there, but this is pretty good. This is going well. So I made it back to my put-in. I'm just gonna bring my canoe up to my truck and uh, yeah, it was a really good day. Thank you guys so much for joining me on this little adventure. I really appreciate it. I hope that you enjoyed it as well. And uh, we'll see you in the next video. Bye.